You work for a big law firm? You better not be going anywhere soon. State Senator Liz Kruger is among a group of legislators alarmed by AI facial recognition used at MSG and Radio City Music Hall, both owned by businessman James Dolan. There's a pattern of James Dolan punishing who he views as his corporate adversaries. Since June 2022, MSG Entertainment has used facial recognition to prevent attorneys from attending events if they work at law firms suing MSG. I mean, a mother was with her kid at a show at Radio City Music Hall. She had to spend two hours walking around in the cold because security wouldn't let her in because she was on, she was on a list not to allow her in because her law firm was on a lawsuit. She wasn't even part of the lawsuit. That is ridiculous. In a statement, MSG Entertainment says, quote, while we understand this policy is disappointing to some, we cannot ignore the fact that litigation creates an inherently adversarial environment. All impacted attorneys were notified of the policy. We continue to make clear that impacted attorneys will be welcomed back to our venues upon resolution of the litigation. MSG says it's complying with all laws, but Manhattan DA Alvin Bragg is reportedly investigating if the policy violates intellectual property laws. And Senator Kruger says the state liquor authority is debating whether it can pull MSG's liquor license. Lawmakers are also considering city and state bans on facial recognition in public accommodations. You're not allowed to discriminate at a hotel or a restaurant or Madison Square Garden. So why should you be allowed to use discriminatory technology? It's wrong and it should be stopped. Lawmakers also want MSG to delete whatever personal data is collected from the AI technology. MSG says that it only retains images of individuals who are prohibited from entering the venues or have been deemed a security threat. Reporting outside of Madison Square Garden, I'm Katie Corrado, PIX11 News.